Last night was the NHL's 2020 All-Star Game where we seen the Women's Hockey League Team Canada and the U.S. get a chance to go out there and show their skills in front of the NHL All-Star Games fans in, in front of the world here where they did a 3v3, two periods worth, and it received, to say the least, a lot of mixed reactions from the interweb once again. And the general consensus seemed to be people wanted to, you know, they wanted to say, hey, I'm not against the women playing hockey, whether they're in, but at the end of the day, that was boring. That was a boring game the 20 minutes worth of hockey to watch and now or here's my thing with this first of all there's a couple of things you have to realize when the women were playing in the all-star game compared to when the men are playing the all-star game first of all when the men are playing in the all-star game they literally do not care right they're just there to make some money and have fun and make a bunch of dirty deeks and everything else it's three on three just to see how many goals they can score so the reason the goal scoring was low you have to realize that the women seen this as a chance to show the world their skills it was their opportunity to show everybody what what they're capable of doing on the ice so when it's a low scoring game you consider it's 20 minutes it's three on three is it that no, was it because of am i gonna go out there and say oh it's their skill is the reason it made it boring no you can't play that game not when you consider how many overtime games go to shootouts in the nhl and three on three after five minutes of play or you have to also consider the fact that the thing i look at here is you think college ball right college football college basketball it's just as popular especially come playoff time as the nba as the nfl is so even if you want to play the skill card here with the women i don't think you can like i'm not going to go out there i'm not personally going to you know play the skill card but there if that's an argument you can't really play that because even at lower skill people enjoy watching the game i think the real issue here for watching women's hockey comes down to the lack of not being able to hit that is a huge problem <laughs> let's play football we're gonna have the women play football though or we'll have the men play football but it's gonna be two hand tap i wouldn't watch it if it was the men playing like that you know like you're it's a it's a game designed around physicality and you're taking the physicality out of it i think that is the biggest gaping hole in the gap between the women and the men of hockey i'm all for them going out there getting the same opportunity as men to play the same sport as men i have no problem with that but you can't change the game and then expect the same people that watch the big game the nhl the big the main sport the professional sport whatever you want to call it you can't expect them to transition and go watch the women play a different game these people came into hockey looking for physicality if i you told me today i could watch hockey tomorrow and there'd be no more hitting what would you think of the sport would you want to watch hockey how many people would find it less interesting probably a lot and I'll be honest, I didn't think it was that bad. I did not see watching that three on three women's game yesterday. It's not like it was like I sat there and watched and picked it apart, you know, limb for limb and said that was just a terrible game. Like, I don't think that was the case. I think it was a case where they was going out there, like I said, they was trying to show what they're capable of doing. They took this game seriously. It's something different. You don't see at an all-star game. So you expect the high scoring games. I think the bigger underlying problem here is the difference between the women's and the men's hockey league isn't the gender. It isn't the skill. It isn't whatever the speed of the game again you can bring up the speed of the game from football to college the nfl big difference in the speed of the game right you can't play that card you can play the card though that it's a different game you are playing a completely different game on the ice from what i've seen from the nhl to the women's you have to let them hit people period